Hello, welcome to another Five Scary Animals in Speculative Zoology. If you haven't already, you need to click the eye in the corner to see the first video with Five Scariest Animals in Speculative Zoology. And it's by me. And I forgot my pointer again. Alright, number five, the Horan from Afterman. Well, the Horan is a creepy creature from Dougal Dixon's Afterman. The Horan is a baboon relative that is permanently on the ground and scavenges from the kill of larger predators like raboons. Like the raboon horns look like a deformed leopard with a monkey face. It's a bit scary. Just look at the hands. Like that hand does not look right. It looks like a leopard until you see the hands and the head. Number four is the Ant-Man from Man After Man. Unlike the Marvel superhero, Ant-Men eat colonial insects like termites and ants. This is the equivalent to the eye eye in the 21st century, using a long middle finger to dig out bugs from the huge mounds that litter the ground. It just doesn't look right. It looks like a human with a big stick on his hand. Everything from Man After Man is just weird or creepy. I don't like it. <laughs> Number three is the gourmand from the new dinosaurs. Gourmands are large relatives of Tyrannosaurus. These scavenging dinosaurs lumber around on two legs, usually intimidating hunters that would so the gourmand can eat. Whole packs of cutlass teeth and dingums can get intimidated by just one gourmand. Also, I'm pretty sure that dingums don't live on the same continent as gourmands. Um, correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure they don't. Alright, number two is another new dinosaur, which is the North Claw. North Claws are mountain lion like dinosaurs slinking around through the grasses of North America. Their single claw helps up, helps the North Claw catch prey like sprintosaurs. Just seeing this thing charge at you is like a bull. Like a bull is already a cause for concern, but then it scoops you out like a can of beans. They only have one giant claw. It's kind of like a mega raptor, but it's more terrifying. <sighs> Honorable mentions the Lurkfish from The Features Wild, the Stringer from After Man, the Aquatic from Man After Man, Dinosauroid version 1. And the Daggerist from Alien Planet. Alright. Number one is the Night Stalker from After Man. This bat relative has given up flying and took to the ground. It uses its hind legs as graspers and the front ones as walkers. Doesn't look right. Its back legs are used as graspers. In the front legs are used as walkings walkers and it has extremely sharp teeth they're like vampire bats but they're four feet tall and they can grab stuff using its ears the night stalker can hear prey from a great distance but cannot see the four-foot creature emits echolocation and listens to its prey using its large ears. So it emits its sound. Uh, sneeze. Alright, never mind. It emits its echolocation and it then bounces back, back to the ears where it can detect it. And then just leap over, bite it, it's dead. It's not very nice. <laughs> I don't I don't like the night stalkers. They're kind of creepy. And that will be it. Also, before this video ends, make sure to like and subscribe to get all of my future notifications because I don't think anyone else is doing this stuff. <laughs> Anyways, 
see you in next video.